up on Darmore today, it's a much clearer day. So I thought I'd take some filming and uh, show you guys what's going on. You can see up there, got a plane spraying a chemtrail that goes all the way back over there. And over here, we've got another plane spraying a chemtrail that goes all the way over there. Here. And then here, you've got a chemtrail and you can follow all the way along to the plane over there. Now, this is not just coincidence, this is a deliberate act by the British government to poison our air in some way, shape or form. And they will not actually admit to it. Which is not really a surprise because they don't admit to anything. So, on evidence of this, and you see it spreading out across the sky, forming milky haze, all the way across there. You can see the milky haze it's formed over there. See? And the way it's spreading and blending into making fake clouds out of chemicals and particulates of aluminium, barium, strontium, arsenic. Sometimes it's believed that there's live microfibers, nanofibers, actual live matter. Again, if you look across here, you can see another plane just started to spray its trail. So we have four live planes in the sky spraying chemtrails across Dartmoor uh, and Devon and the southwest and pretty much over the whole of the western world without anybody telling us what it's all about. So write to your government, write to your MP, Write to your local council, write to your environmental health officer, but tell them that you want to know about chemtrails, because we need answers, and we need answers right now, before it's too late, and they either kill us all off or destroy our world. So remember, chemtrails. Have a look at some of my other videos, and that will show you that not just this is not just a one-off, but there's plenty of proof. So, thank you for your time. And uh, I'll leave you with this thought. If we have a government and a Prime Minister that's not willing to make a comment on the genocide of 2,000 people in Gaza, then they're quite capable of doing this to their fellow man. Take care now.